If you need help choosing classes for the upcoming semester, watch this video to see some of the tools available to guide you in course selection. First, we'll go over the program audit feature on Lancer Point. Then we'll cover program maps as another option on the PCC website. Sign into Lancer Point and navigate to your Lancer plan under My Classes and Academics. Then click on Program Audit in the upper left. If you have declared a major, this feature will show your progress, including outstanding or unfulfilled requirements, coursework that has been completed, and courses or areas that are still in progress. Scroll down to find a degree overview and continue scrolling to navigate to other sections that show the completion status of areas, subcategories, and specific courses. A green check mark means that that course or area of requirement has been completed successfully. This indicator may not update until after final grades post. A blue circle that is partially filled in represents a category with courses that are still in progress. If you are currently enrolled in a course and the grades have not been posted, it should show in a section at the bottom of the page called pre-registered and the grade will display as IP or in progress. An empty red circle indicates a requirement that has not been completed. Areas that are incomplete will generally display course options that will satisfy that requirement. Click on each course number and a window will pop up with more information about that class. Scroll down to view available seats for each section of this course being offered in the spring. When you find an open section that works with your schedule, use the CRN to add the class on the add slash drop classes page on Lancer Point. Repeat this process for any additional classes you would like to add. Keep an eye out for courses that have prerequisites listed. If you haven't completed the prerequisite, you won't be able to add this class. PCC also has program maps for dozens of degree and certificate programs. On the PCC website, click on Academics and Support, then select Degrees and Certificates. Choose from Associate's Degrees, Career Technical Education Degrees, or Certificate Programs, then locate your major or area of emphasis. Click on the link for your major to open a page with more information about that program. Scroll down to see a list of requirements, or click on View Program Maps on the left-hand side to open up the list of options for that career community. Click on the option you want to open up the Program Map page, which begins with a description of the program, the learning outcomes, and a section that explores salary, careers, and job growth projections. Continue scrolling to locate the courses outlined in the Program Map. This overview shows one possible pathway through the program, though the required courses may be completed in a slightly different order. Use the legend at the top to see which courses are listed as major specific, which ones are general education requirements, and more. Black lines linking one course to another typically indicate prerequisites, meaning the first course listed will need to be completed before the next one in the series can be attempted. When reading each box on the program map, it's important to understand that you may see a specific course, multiple course options, or a general requirement area. Click on these boxes and a window will pop up listing all possible options for satisfying this requirement area. When you've identified a class that you want, you can search for that course on the schedule of classes. Identify a CRN for an open section, then use it to add that course on the add slash drop classes page on Lancer Point. If nothing is available, head back to the Program Maps page to select another option. The tools that we have covered today are available anytime and can help you to explore program requirements and make informed decisions about choosing classes. Remember, you will generally have at least a few days after classes start to make changes to your schedule, so it is recommended that you reserve your space in the classes you want as soon as possible, then make changes later if needed.